ICSR Industrial Consultancy and Sponsored Research of NIF Rank 1 IIT Madras a building which is responsible for interacting with industries research organization and government agency for taking up consultancy and sponsored research projects this is responsible for you to get into iit without any gate exam through sponsor project with the sponsor project they have covered more than 5000 crore project till now and also filed a patent of 2500 plus patent all over so in this video we'll see what is it all about and get to know in detail and how you can get into iit without a gate score okay so sir we have come to another very very interesting department of iit madras that is industrial consultancy and sponsored research yes. in my opinion uh, whenever some professor get some industrial project yes. and uh, that is taken as a consultancy so this is the building in which that everything is done maybe it's financial aspect and all and projects to be taken from industries to be done professor is one of the consultant in that so that generates a resource for the iit i think that entire activity is done here only so that is a very very important activity as far as industry academia interactions are concerned yes. so uh, i believe this one is also relatively new department or something uh, basically it is right now reconstructed you can see uh, okay. it's completely new building new okay yeah mm. and we'll have insight of it what process is going on what mm. happens here mm. and how industry comes and professors domain match together okay. and how they are funded because it is very important aspect that uh, students get admission in ms via gate score but mm. many can get it directly mm. um, uh, as you through say projects. yes mm. through project you need to mail to the professor if mm. professor find that you would be helpful mm. to carry out the project mm. that industry has given to them mm. so he can take you and also give sponsorship so mm. this is so is there idrp somewhere related to this kind of uh, department only yeah we'll have a look at it whether okay it then is. only we will link to issue yes. so that means the projects which are taken from industries uh, and yes. our uh, you know professors are yeah uh, working on those projects that entire domain is related to this building right yes definitely so i think we need to explore it more sir yes. and tell students about it yeah we'll have a look at it have insight of it and let's see what's inside it Come okay on. hello everyone we are at iit madras at icsr the full form is industrial consultancy and sponsored research so basically we would be showing you complete inside of this so first of all what does this our uh, department does it is like a building what do you say yeah it is basically office okay so i would say it is a office where industries project are connected with the professors of the specialized department and further with the help of students <coughs> the project is accomplished and the desired project output is delivered to the industries so we have with us anvesh here he would be showing us and telling about what happens here so basically this is a four story building starting with the ground floor and on the ground floor we are having different auditoriums for different events if our institute would want to conduct any event for industry or for some uh, department so we go to the ttj auditorium and it is having other things as well the annexure hall and dining hall and poster presentation hall these kind of things and on the first floor we are having patent office if you want to get any patent so anvesh in past many years we have seen that our student or our innovation are never getting patent uh, they create something they create a uh, innovation but generally it is student don't have such knowledge of getting it patented and other countries are stealing it so here there is a patent office i would like to share our viewers with what is it about and what happens there so basically the scenario in india is changing now we are focusing more on patent uh, patentability we want some intellectual property to get registered in the globe so what we are doing is we are having one office if you are having any uh, idea or if you are doing some research and you want to publish it so before publishing it what they say you come to us you show us what you are going to publish if there is some patentability thing so we will patent that and then you can publish so this is one thing and if we see the past records we are having around 2200 patents wow iit madras is focusing on one patent per day policy and so you will be happy to hear that 
last month we have filed around 36 patents so we have crossed the bar of one patent per day so this is it and there is a, always a dream inside a student of engineering colleges that they have to get into IIT college uh, enjoy the IIT lifestyle and all others that he has always heard about so basically they are always a, a master student are competing on the basis of gate exam <coughs> so is there any way that they can enter into IITs without gate so what are the ways to enter into IIT one is jam one is gate one is J but there are other ways as well so if you are not <coughs> having these uh, if you have not cleared these exams in your life but still you want to be a part of IIT so what you can do is there are many projects which are being supported by ICSR so if you are interested you can apply to those projects and then you can come here as project staff and project associates okay for the MS basically uh, you were telling about HTRA and other categories hmm. so what is HTRA and how the industries is involved in getting student uh, admission here and getting their degrees throw some light on it so HTRA is not the only category to get into IIT there are other categories as well one is NHTRA where we, you will not get any stipend from AICT or MHRD you can get the stipend from the institute as well or your uh, professor must be having some projects or something or consultancy project or some sponsor project where you will be getting these fundings from him and another category is MS project in the project category you will be working for a particular project there you will be completing that project uh, and as your MS thesis so this is one uh, one category and and one more category is also there MS external where you need not to come to institute regu on regular basis you just need to attend some classes for completing the coursework and then you can do rest of the work from out of the institute so in HTRA MS student are getting a stipend of around 12,400 hmm and so if they are joining any project based uh, so is they are getting the same stipend or it may be variable according to the professor or according to the project interestingly you can get a huge amount of scholarship and stipend under the NHTRA and project categories the minimum amount you will get is 25,000 so 25 okay. is the minimum bar and you can get anything which a professor can, is willing to offer yes and some statistically data about how much sponsored projects have been carried out here so if you combine consultancy and sponsored projects both so the amount will be reaching around 5000 crores wow, till huge. now 5000 crore is amazing yeah so in the end i would like to conclude that in icsr building industrial projects are connected with the professor and the students in a case you get an opportunity to get into admission into IITs and work with pro project which is under the industries also and also you get an advantage of getting your things patent and other stuff right so if you like the video and like the insight of it do like the video comment and share with your friends and please don't forget to subscribe your PDA channel and also with this there is BS data science degree yeah. that is just about it which is a huge topic to be discussed we will cover this in another video so thank you